What's up, y'all? It's your boy Venom coming back at y'all again today with another reaction. And today we getting into some more new artists on the channel. We are breaking new ground here, folks. We got Sleep Token. A new enemy has arrived. A new challenger has arrived. Sleep Token. All right. I've seen so many reactors reacting to Sleep Token. I have no idea really what they're about i know that they're alternative uh rock and a couple other genres so i'm actually prepared for that um but you never know this day and age they could randomly rap they could randomly do this they could randomly do that so i'm here for it. i'm here to experience it i know a lot of people are really messing with sleep token heavily as this song has one million views so yeah not sure why I couldn't find the original Sleep Token song, or the Ascensionism song. Not sure why I can only really find this one, the lyric video. So, yeah. So, we're just going to do that one either way. Sorry about that. So, if there is an official music video that you guys think I do have to check out, let me know down below, and I will. So, yeah. I know this is a band, and they are alternative rock alt rock so that's all i know i don't know what they're about i don't know what they what they do um another fact that i know about them is that they all wear masks it's kind of similar to you know like guar but not really because guar is more heavy metal and it's an actual costume whereas they all just have masks so i don't even know if their identity is even known to anybody like i'm sure it is kind of like the gorillas how gorillas um they were just you know an animated band but obviously they were real people i believe they're from the uk that are behind the voices of the guys and gorillas so we're gonna find out we're gonna find out right now what we have here this is a long video this is seven minutes and 12 seconds so i'm gonna try not to pause as much as i normally would just because this is already gonna be a long video and yeah, I got the lyrics over here in case I do need them. And guys, if you're new around here, if you wouldn't mind giving a like, a comment, or a subscribe would matter a lot to me. And I do truly appreciate it. So let's get right on into it, y'all. Sleep Token Ascensionism. Put on the cans and let's get right to it. Let's full screen this bad boy and let's do it. Better back out, back in. There we go. See what we got here with Sleep Token. They look hardcore, though. I'm surprised I'm hearing the soft piano here in the beginning because they, they look hardcore. But they are alternative rock, so I get it. Nice soft melodic intro here. Well, I know what you want from me you want someone to be your Reflection, your bitter deception, setting you free. Okay. So you take what you want, then All right, so we're starting off with just a simple intro. Uh, I know you want from me. You want to be. You want someone to become your reflection, your better deception. That's something that's obviously true. That obviously can stem from the Oedipus complex, stemming from you know uh, every guy uh, has feelings for their mother that isn't maternal. It's a little more than that, which is eh. 
obviously he's not talking about this. He's just talking about a woman who wants a man to be her in her ideal image of what a man should be. But obviously every man is different. There's not a one true real good version of a man or a woman. You know what I mean? So, all right, let's see what we got here. Really slow though, so far. Who made you like this? Who encrypted your dark gospel in body language? Synapses snap back in blissful language. Tell me you met me in past lives, past life, past what might be eating me from the inside. Darling. Oh, all right. Okay, so they switch it up. Thankfully, I was really hoping the whole song wasn't just so slow as that where you get two bars in a minute. But yeah, who made you like this? Who encrypted your dark gospel in body language? Synapses snap back in blissful anguish. Guys, I think I just might have discovered some actual poets here because the way that they're attacking the beat like this and the way that they're phrasing it uh, seems like that of a poet, you know, who encrypted your dark gospel in your body language. And also I didn't think they were going to go into this type of, where's the language and the language, you know what I mean? It's, it's definitely more modern. I'm not really sure who kind of started this. I initially want to think post Malone because I don't, in my experience remember anybody really rapping or not rapping singing like this with the hair hey, hey, how you have that like ending there like you make it kind of like a i don't want to call it a yodel but kind of like a yodel you know what i mean it's deep in your language in your anguish like you you have like a kind of like a spongebob ah, thing going it's it's unique and i didn't expect this to come from this group considering what they look like but i guess this is just a perfect example of you just can't judge a book by its cover right Lipstick chem trails, red flags, pink nails. Hold on a second. Because first of all, verse two went off. Because anything's better than the way I feel right now. I can offer you a backlit paradise. Diamonds in the trees. Pentagrams in the night sky. What I like about this is that they're going not really all over the place. Like there is a genuine topic here for the Ascensionism. Uh, obviously, that's the name of the song, but we got something going on here that I really like. Half algorithm, half deity, glitches in the code or gaps in a sh in a strange dream. Tell me you guessed my future and it mapped onto your fantasy. Turn me into your mannequin. And I'll turn you into my puppet queen. Oh, the way that they just broke that down and the way that they delivered that by saying that, like, turn me into your mannequin and I'll turn you into my puppet queen. I like that. Like I said earlier, it's, it's poetry, really. Oh. 
I like that. So how he said, uh, you know, blood stains on the collar means just don't ask. Be the first to the feast. Let's choke on the past. So blood stain on the collar. Another word for a collar is a choker because it chokes you. Let's choke on the past and take to the broken skies at last. All right, guys. I like sleep token. I do. I do. It doesn't sound... It doesn't only just sound good. It's poetry here. I like this. So right now we're just getting a straight up solo from the actual band, not just um, really where the main focus is on the singer. Okay, now they can actually show their talent as drummers, guitarists, and bassists. Let's see what we got. Same as me. My redemption is on the power. The sanction sets in me free. Okay. So I'll turn what I want. Then leave. Okay. As a first introduction to Sleep Token, let me say this. I am truly not disappointed at all. I liked how it goes from, you know, very soft to hard drops like that. And then, you know, in the beginning, it's a little slow. And then they raise the tempo for the verses. Guys, I liked it a lot, actually. And yeah, they can rip too. Their guitarist, their bassist, and their drummer is nasty. And I love those drops, those hard, heavy drops. If you all have seen any of my other reactions that is at all involved with rock, 
you will know that I do love those drops, especially on songs like, you know, Ronald falling in reverse or watch the world burn. You know, those kind of drops. That's what I'm here for. This didn't really have that much of a heavy prolific drop, but it still had it. It still had the drops that I was looking for. Yeah, guys, all around fire. I I enjoy Sleep Token. Now I know. So let me know down below if there's anything else by them that I should check out, especially something that y'all want me to review and react to. And I most certainly will because, like I said, I rock with Sleep Token. So, yeah, guys, this was a pleasure. And as always, I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.